Roswell Flight Test Crew here at CES 2018 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm here talking to Mike McColville. How you doing, Mike? I'm good. Good. Thanks for the opportunity to talk to you and talk about our new stuff. Yeah, now speaking of your new stuff, even for Unique, this is something unique. What are you holding there? Yeah, this is the Firebird FPV, and it is very unique for Unique. Um, it is our first, essentially our first fixed wing drone. As the name implies, Firebird FPV means the, the key point of this product is a, an FPV experience, a first person view comes out of the box ready to use. But the real big difference is we're leveraging our drone technology. So it's a, it's a digital video downlink, a low latency uh, video downlink, about 100 millisecond or less latency, which is, which is virtually instantaneous, which just takes it to the next level. It makes it a really uh, immersive flight experience. It's like being in the cockpit of an airplane. It also has a range out to 500 meters, gives you the ability to fly a really huge area. So the, the new controller we have is the ST10C, uh, which is very compact and supports iOS or Android. There's apps for both. The Unique Experience app for the Firebird has a full OSD on-screen display, which gives you basically the instrument complement that you would have in a full-scale airplane. So it gives you artificial horizon, ground speed, altitude, distance from home, um, everything you need to be able to fly first-person view. You can fly either with the uh, phone in the controller or it can go into a headset, which comes with the airplane, slide your headphone in, put it in FPV mode, and then fly completely first person view. Now you mentioned this incorporates unique drone technology. So is there like a GPS receiver in here? Yes, absolutely. The flight controller, this is GPS enabled. Um, so the GPS system gives us the ability to, to kind of fully constrain the flight which makes it you know, one of the reasons that, that anyone can fly. You don't have to know how to fly model airplanes to fly this. It also has a return home, return home loiter, uh, much like, like multi-rotor drones. So if you know, you're to the point where you, you just want to enjoy the ride and watch the, the video, or it's out and you're not quite sure where you are and how to get back, just hit return home and the airplane will turn around, fly back to the home point and just circle above head until you want to cancel and take control over again. And then most importantly, because the real killer for anybody learning to fly airplanes is landing. That's where he crashed. It has auto land. It really works well. We've put a lot of time into the auto land system. Now, does this, like other unique drones, have multiple flight modes? Yeah, absolutely. It has three, three flight modes. Um, the first I'll call acro mode, and that's, that's a mode that uh, would be for, for experienced model airplane flight, people who know how to fly. In that mode, the Firebird will fly much like other model airplanes. It'll roll, it'll fly upside down, but you have to know how to fly. If you don't and you go give the wrong input, you know, it could crash. But we've got that taken care of up with the stability mode and one we call safety mode. So it has roll limit, has pitch limit, so you can't roll upside down, you can't loop it upside down, full stick input, just a full, a full stick input like that will bank the airplane to about 45 degrees and, and it'll just turn. So it makes it as easy as steering a car around. And the other part of that is self-leveling. So just release the sticks and the airplane levels itself and no matter where it's at, it'll correct itself. The safety mode is really cool mode. It has all the same features as stability with the addition of a feature we call floor, uh, which is essentially a hard deck that you can define in the app. And when you're in that mode, the airplane, it cannot descend below that altitude. Even at low throttle, if you pull the power all the way back and let it glide, it'll glide down to that altitude and then the system will modulate the throttle as needed to keep it flying at, you know, at that altitude and not below. And this is a really powerful feature and it makes, it's a really fun feature, even for experienced pilots, because the, the kind of the best thing to do when you go fly is kind of look around and, and figure out what your highest obstacle is and go into the app and set the, the floor altitude at, you know, just above that. And then there's no worries of hitting anything. So you can, you can take off, even throttle all the way back and just cruise around in, in uh, safety mode and you know, explore you know, and, and low throttle too. The flight time will be probably 30 minutes. Well, I think you finally made a fixed wing aircraft that even I can't crash. So I'm looking forward to trying it. I'm looking forward to you trying it too. I think you'll enjoy it. Now, final question is when's this going to be available and what's it going to cost? Um, it'll be available first half of this year. Um, cost will be $5.99. Good deal. All right. Well, thanks so much for your time. My pleasure. Thank you for the opportunity to, to tell you about it. Absolutely. And from CES 2018, this is the Roswell Flight Desk Crew signing off. <laughs>